Hello everyone, happy holidays. Yay, finally. I'm super excited for the holidays. I hope you are too. It's finally a really nice distraction and I have decorated the house already and I'm ready for Christmas, ready for Thanksgiving. And um, yeah, so today I put together a journal lover's gift guide. So whether you are the journal lover watching this video or you're looking for somebody who's really into journaling and you don't know what to get them for Christmas, um, this is a video for you and um, I've given this some thought and to make this a more special gift and for me some main criteria were the quality of the notebooks, um, the presentation and the packaging and then also how personal you can make the gift. So I put together seven different ideas for you that I'm going to get into. It's going to be a little bit of a longer video so grab some eggnog and enjoy. All right, so my first suggestion for you are Epica Leather Journals. Um, I've done several videos on this company before in my journal. They make incredible journals that are mostly handmade in Italy. They use Italian leather, Italian paper. It's an extremely high quality product. It is extremely impressive when you open the gift, like every journal comes with this uh, gift pouch which is really nice um, velvety soft a pouch with this lining in here it's like satin it looks really incredible when you first get it I remember my first time I got an Epica journal I was super impressed and like really blown away about how everything is put together and um, they give you usually also like a free pen that comes with um, the package I can get in there. There you go. As you can see, it says Epica here. And then they also send, I don't know if they still do this, but they send little leather cleaner samples for the leather journals. They send little postcards and thank you notes. And it's a super, super high end luxury experience um, in terms of opening this. And me as a journal lover, I would be blown away by receiving this as a gift. If you're not into leather journals, they also have a vegan option out there that's not leather. So you can see this gorgeous pouch here. This, and then all the journals can be embossed and personalized. So in terms of making this more personal and embossing this for whoever purchases uh, for, it's a really, really nice touch. And actually when you emboss this, the journal does not come in the pouch. It actually comes even better in a huge huge gift box that looks incredible and if you want to see this check out one of my other videos where i did an in-depth review on these journals and my favorite two actually as i said this is the vegan option but my favorite two are the classic letter journal that has this really medieval antique look like you would find this in really old libraries and this is actually a refillable journal so once you fill this up you can take this out and put in a new one and the refill is actually quite affordable and they come with a bookmark and i've filled this up so there's some personal writing i don't really want to get into this but it is gorgeous gorgeous paper it's super fountain pen friendly i actually enjoyed writing in a fountain pen with this and then this one is called their softest leather journal and no kidding it is the softest leather i've ever felt in my life it's like feathery smooth and incredible to touch and it's hand stitched and then it's getting there it's those deckled edges that are hand torn and it's just a really really high-end um, luxury journal that comes with a price tag but i think it's worth it it's really special and if you want to save 15% off this purchase, I have a discount code. It's JournalJoy15. I'm going to put the link in the description box. You can save yourself some money if you want to impress a journal lover or if you want to send this video to somebody that's looking for a gift for you as a journal lover. I'm just saying, you know, send this video. Tell them, like, get me something from this video. Um, anyway, so that was my first suggestion. Really super high quality, fountain pen friendly notebooks incredible the way it's being presented when you open the box and you can personalize it by embossing it so the second one is getting them a journal made by the company galen leather they're in turkey they take again great great pride in their products 
when you receive this it's a really nice presentation their packaging the design is absolutely incredible in my opinion this is a magnetic closure on this here can you hear this it's like an apple product it is really really nice and they have these gorgeous toma river paper leather journals let's see here and then they come with these line guides here um there and as you can see there's like a blotter paper that also feels like almost like it's leather it's really really nice and high quality and they give you a little gift pouch and again postcards and super personal touch when you open this in the mail it, again it's really impressive the way they present their product really so much care and detail that goes into this this is this gale leather company made in turkey as i said they use 52 gsm toma river paper that is white and it's a really nice quality notebook you can bend it over all the way it lies flat if you're journal lover or you the journal lover you use fountain pens you know how fountain pen friendly um toma river paper is while well, being super 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 thin so i said it 50 gsm is one of the thinnest papers out there in terms of journal paper it's really 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 nice so this is their forest green i believe and then they have a second one color here i think they're available in three different sizes like this is i think a b6 and a6 and then this is the a5 just check out their website and look what they have and also what they sell as well is pen cases and they have a few fountain pens so what i think would look really nice is to get somebody a notebook with this packaging and then add a matching pen case or a little fountain pen they partnered with Caveco the fountain pen company and then the fountain pen comes in the same type of packaging and it looks really nice together as a gift I think it's extremely impressive I'd be impressed getting this for Christmas so that is my second option for you guys really really nice presentation and also great quality product all right the number three here is a notebook by the company Papier. They have tons of different designs on their journals. This is the Demi notebook. And why I chose this? Because this is the notebook that you can personalize the most. You can literally like fill this entire top half with writing. Um, you can go on the website, you can choose the size of the font, the actual font, what you want to have written there. You can even write like a whole poem there or like a special memory. Um, make it to their like other hobby that they have. I don't know if they go fly fishing, like something that's really personal to them or a special date that you always want to remember. And when putting this together, actually the idea for all the guys out there, if you want to propose to your girl and she loves journals, imagine if you write there for example, Jessica, will you marry me? Love John or something like that. I mean, I would say yes, quite frankly. I mean, that would be an incredible idea if she opens it up and she can say yes. I mean, there's tons of things you can do with this because it is um, so personalizable. What's the word? I'm not sure. You can make this super personal. Uh, this is a quote that I love, everything lies within that I selected um, and wanted on there. But you can do whatever you want here. A set of tons of different options. This is a lined notebook with, um, I think it's 85 GSM paper, nice quality paper. And as I said, go on a website and make a super personal gift for your special journal lover. Um, yeah, that's another idea that I had for you guys. So feel free to check that out. That is number three. All right, let's move on. Next one is a traveler's notebook. A lot of people that are in the journals love the traveler's notebook so i picked one here this is made by the company Rubersim. Um what i like about this is that it is a medium-sized traveler's notebook most of them are either passport size or they're fairly smaller than the large um classic size that are really tall and elongated and i don't love that format but i really like this medium sized here and what's also great is that it has this little buckle here that's a little bit more special and then it opens up like this and what's great about it it comes fully filled with a plastic pouch and then these three inserts that are 64 pages each and i think they're around 100 
100 GSM paper. If I don't, if I'm not mistaken, on this crap paper in the middle. So you already have like a fully loaded traveler's notebook at a decent price point that you can just give somebody, and it comes also in this little pouch. So that's, I think, another great option for journal lovers out there. And um, yes, let's move on. Again, if you love leather journals, why well, I picked this company is Rustico. They take a lot of pride and care in their products as well. And if you live in the US and you wanna support a local US based company, um, this is another great way to go because most standard um, journals are made in Asia and China. And here you actually support business to business within the US. And I think they make outstanding journals as well. They have a little bit more of a rustic look to it. They have tons of different colors and options on the website. What I really like also as a gift idea is their five-year journal, which is a bit more unusual where you can write down every year you get a journal prompt. For example, an opportunity I'm anxious to tackle and you can answer this year and then all the next five years. And you see how you all evolve all over the years, how your answers change. So for people that maybe even have a bit of a writing block to get a little journal prompt here and have something to write about and fill out and um, this is their natural color so it means this will age over time because it's untreated leather and then they have um uh, this is a wrapped tie journal i took off the wrap and i filled this one up already nice paper quality nice thick paper that's um has quite a bit of teeth to it i don't think i filled this up fully so you can see the paper again these tor hand tor uh, torn edges deckled edges here that give it this nice rustic look um yeah and they also have a like the one before travelers notebook style notebook as well but it only comes with one insert so if you want to fully load it one get the one i mentioned before rubber seam and then if not you can pick a rustico one and the leather here with these journals smells absolutely amazing in my opinion so this is another option for you guys and i will link everything down below so you know you can always refer back to that and um so this was number five rustico and now we do number six and that is get a nice quality notebook with great paper that is fountain pen friendly and I think one of the best papers out there is paper made by the company Clairefontaine and it's used in Clairefontaine notebooks it's used in this notebook it's the Kulvaris Habana and I also I filled this up already so I don't want to show you too much it is a really smooth paper I think it is I believe 90 GSM paper and also this type of paper is used in notebooks made by the company Rodia. So what you could do, I was thinking if somebody um, has gotten into journaling recently or in more recent years, or they've never even considered using a fountain pen, like maybe as a gift for a teenager, somebody who's in college, or maybe just somebody who's never thought of elevating their writing experience by using a fountain pen, you could get a really fountain pen friendly notebook like this one. Again, I'm gonna link everything down below. This is option number six here with a nice fountain pen for beginners and i have to admit i'm not a fountain pen expert i don't use fountain pens a ton sometimes i like using this one and just getting into the flow because uh with a, writing with a fountain pen gives you extremely smooth writing experience because essentially you don't need to apply any pressure to fountain pen it just effortlessly glides over the page and just can let your thoughts flow and really get into as a called the flow state and just you know be creative with that so what i would recommend for a beginner's fountain pen is the pilot red metropolitan and why because most um, fountain pens at this prime price point are made out of plastic this is made out of steel so it's a little bit more high-end feeling in my opinion and nicer than just a plastic fountain pen and it's a great great fountain pen for under or around twenty dollars again i'm gonna find it for you i'm gonna put a link description so this is my option number six for getting people that love to journal into a fountain pen experience and then last but not least what i thought what you could also do is 
again, get a book on journaling or on creating a writing routine. Maybe you have somebody that loves to journal, but they kind of fall off on and off the journal wagon. And sometimes they're like frustrated with that. Again, you could get a nice notebook like the one we showed you, the Colada Savannah, and pair it with a book about writing, journaling, like this one here, The Artist's Way by Julie, Julie Cameron. I highly recommend this book. It really helped me um, solidify my daily journaling routine. Um, there's also tons of other books on journaling. Just put journaling into Amazon. You'll find tons of options. As I said, I like this one. And then another um, idea alongside with this is a lot of people love bullet journaling especially if you have a journal lover that's more coming from an organizational aspect with the journaling in terms of organizing their day in their life by writing things down in a notebook and not so much journaling about their inner world and their emotions and what's going on more like making to-do lists and using it as like a planet calendar type you could get this um bullet journal here so they could try bullet journaling or if they're already into it and then uh pair it with the guided invented bullet journaling. I think his name is Ryder Carroll. He wrote a book on how to bullet journal and how to organize your uh, life. I have not read it. I don't own the book, but I've heard great things about it. So you could pair the bullet journal how to book with the actual bullet journal. So that was my last idea for you guys. And then, you know, and if you're still completely uncertain, just ask the person that's a journal lover what type of notebook they want uh, people like us we always are jonesing for some new notebook that we've seen online or somewhere or some instagram post i mean there's always a new notebook we're dying to try and and that looks really incredible to us and we're like it's yeah it's a little bit of an addiction there's you know always that next notebook that you want to try and um, check out and that you're excited about so just ask them what they want that's like you know my last suggestion for you so i hope this helped as i said i'm going to put everything in the description box it's going to be you know a lot of links in there but i hope it kind of like makes sense by the way i laid this out for you guys and if you have any more questions please feel free to comment have, leave me a comment if you have any more ideas for fellow notebook lovers and things they could get just also put it in the comments for other people and give them more ideas and su suggestions would uh, you would you know like to get as a journal lover so people can I look into that even more so i wish you all a wonderful holiday season whatever you're celebrating and i hope you're doing well and if you've enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you want to see more notebook videos or in-depth in videos on the other um, notebooks i just showed you just check out my channel feel free to subscribe and i thank you so much for watching